Good afternoon, Carla. It's Friday. So, I just finished watching your video and you made some really great points about how this project is coming to an end. And it's kind of sad because I only have one week left until I'm done and I'm done on Friday of next week. So, there's not that much time left until I'm home for the summer and this project will have come to a close. It won't be quite a year that we've been doing it, but it will be a good long time. I'm really proud of what we've done because we started this project as just like an exercise to see if we could do things by ourselves and to really find a distance between you and me. And it was also training us for next year when we both go abroad and when we won't be able to text each other and to constantly like talk to each other as we did last year and as we will do after this project is done. And I think we've, we've done pretty well in that if we had a question and we couldn't call each other, we had to figure it out. And so it's really just trying to find how we can do things ourselves and not have it be an absolute dire situation that we need to see each other. And I think it, it was really cool. Yesterday was our senior dinner for rugby. So we said one of our final goodbyes to our seniors. Tonight is Senior Olympics and then Sunday we have our very last game with the seniors. And it's gonna be really sad. Some of them made speeches and they talked about how this team has changed them and how much they love this team and they love the family that has come out of it. And I realized that I've only been on this team for a year and I still know very little about rugby, but I have found that I love these people that I play with and that I spend so much time with and I wouldn't want to trade this for anything. And this has been a really tough year for me because I had to start all over again because I changed my major and because I switched schools from the School of Fine Arts to the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences, I had to figure out what I had to do to start all over again. So I basically started as a freshman and I just carried in a couple of credits. So I'm trying to do the equivalent of graduating a semester early, which is a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. It's a lot of work that I didn't think I was going to have to do. And joining the team made me realize that I can do all that work and I can still make friends and I can still do something that I love. And I didn't know that I was going to love rugby as much as I do. I thought it was just gonna be something like the Taekwondo team last year where it was just something that I did that was, it was cool for a little bit. But with this team, I really found people that I genuinely enjoy hanging out with and I love taking classes with them and I really just enjoy like hanging out. I see Rosie three days a week in my Spanish class. This is our third semester taking Spanish together. I see Tanae almost every single day and it's just great because I get to hang out with these people and I have found people and friends that I didn't think I was going to find and I thought that I was just going to be the person that I was when I came into college in that I was okay being by myself and I was just going to be alone the whole time and I found people that I really enjoy hanging out with and I'm really excited to see what happens next and I'm kind of sad that I won't get to see some of my friends graduate and I won't get to be there for their senior dinner because I will be abroad but I know that I will have been changed as a person because I met them, because I got to play rugby with them, because I got to learn from them and with them. So I really, I really, really enjoyed that. That is what I have for you today, Carla. I'm a little bit jealous that you're done and that I still have a week left, but I get to see you soon. So that's exciting. Carla, I'll see you tomorrow.